Would you believe more than one song? More than one, they might have had, it might have been big in the 80s, but oh my word, live as well. Good God. Oh, <laughs> the final countdown here. Hey, you even listening? Yeah, yeah, uh, price of cheese, yeah. What? Every once in a while, you just have to drive a car really fast, even if you're a Hollywood A-lister, such as Sylvester Stallone. Based on the well-known blockbuster, <clears throat> Driven follows the events of the film closely, I'm assuming. Problem is, Driven is based on IndyCar racing, so it's mostly turning left on a not very interesting oval circuit. The career mode fares no better. There is a story here somewhere, but between the overly excited announcer, played by Greg Proops, and Sly's incessant mumblings, it gets lost, much like the gameplay. Whilst there is a unique concept, drive well enough and you get into the zone. The car handling is nothing less than shonky. The graphics wouldn't look out of place on PlayStation 1 and lack the sheen of what a good PS2 game should look like. So Driven really should be steered uh -huh! clear of and go and pick up Gran Turismo 4 instead. At least that has corners which go in another direction. <laughs>